KG7TUL here. I just wanted to do a quick video on an antenna I built. Uh, whipped it together in about 30 minutes. We were talking about antennas and making different kinds of antennas out of different kinds of things. And I mentioned using barbed wire. And I was told that barbed wire would not work for an antenna. So, being me, I decided to build one. And this is what I came up with in about 30 minutes with a couple of slivers of uh, scrap plywood and two pieces of barbed wire and some feed line. So I'll zoom in on it here and hopefully we can see it. The feed line, if you can notice, I don't know if you can tell, but it's not soldered. Feed line is zip tied onto that little cross. There's two zip ties making the cross. Feed line's under it, one of them. And it's just twisted around the barbed wire. And the barbed wire goes up. Zip tied on there. I didn't even take the time to cut it off. And then a zip tie at the top to hang it from. That's not where I transmitted from. And I used this for two weeks. And people were amazed. As you can see, I didn't even cut the zip ties off there. And then the cross piece is simply to bring the feed line away at a 90 degree or thereabouts. It's a rather sloppily built antenna. And I only had to trim the barbed wire once. And it worked just fine at full power even, 75 watts on a uh, Yesu FT2900. I'll see if I can get something closer on the uh, elements. As you can see, it's just wrapped around and the zip ties are holding the center conductor and the shield from the coax onto the barbed wire. And there's the barbs. Worked pretty well.